All right, guys, Kenny Santucci back with the Fit Aid Show here at the final day of the CrossFit Games. And we got a team that just finished up, took 19th place, not too shabby, but I wanted to grab them and chat with them a little bit because I got two friends with me. And they are took 19th place, which isn't bad, and they're from my home state, greatest country in the world, New Jersey. Yep. So you're the owner of CrossFit Parallax. I am, yes. And where'd you find these two monsters? Um, so I had, we were pretty much just mutual friends, um, and about a year ago we started working out together a lot through the summertime, um, just, you know, a couple days a week, and we were thinking, like, we have a lot of really good individuals, <laughs> like, we, we have to try team, there's, it's kind of a no-brainer, so it just fell into place. And now when you guys, going into the open, I mean, how'd everybody do individually? How was everybody scored? You were pretty high up there, right? Um... A little bit over 100. Yeah. yeah. Not too shabby, Not right? Too shabby, I'd no. take that all day long. <laughs> Top Kelsey? 60. Top 60. Yeah. Big improvements from, from yeah. their last year's yeah. um, over 200 yeah. places. Yeah. I qualified individual, which was like kind of a goal for me to just say I could do it again. Yeah. And then just to, you know, pull them with me as like momentum going through every week and just, you know, putting up big scores and like, our girls just went from you know in the top hundred spots to top 60 was like huge improvement you hear it a lot of times everybody says like oh if you're gonna put together a team your team relies on how how good your girls are yeah. I mean would you guys agree with that oh, yeah yeah because yeah. Yeah. I feel like the guys are gonna put up big numbers all the time it doesn't matter like if you're on a, a team you're you're a pretty strong dude but it's the girls that are like really make or break the team right yeah. so Coming into regionals, right? I remember talking to Kelsey and she's like, hey, we want to get some Fit Aid gear. How can you hook us up? Mm -hmm. So I put her in touch with Aaron. I was like, oh, you know, Vince is on the team. So you guys get hooked up. And I'm like, oh yeah, they'll, I'm sure they'll do pretty good. I mean, all, and then you guys take second. <laughs> you guys took second in the region. Yeah, only lost by four points. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> four points. So were you guys expecting that? I mean, going into the regional, what was on your mind? Where you, where you be like, ah, we'll just place. You know. The goal was always games bound. Um, I think it was just, we had, you know, different levels of experience on our team. So me, you know, just being with, being at regionals before it was like, guys, you don't understand how good we could be. Like yeah. we, we should be able to make it to the games. There's no doubt in my mind. And, you know, some of us were just kind of like, like, oh my gosh, like, is, could that be? And I think the other other half of us was like, it's happening. So we pulled, <laughs> we just pulled them with us. Like, no, you gotta, you gotta have the confidence and you gotta believe in it. And it was, we knew we would do well at regionals. We had rehearsed the workouts many times before and we're seeing other regions go before us. So we're looking at their times going like, look what we can do. So we didn't expect it, but we were, you know, really confident going in. So have any of you guys ever been to the games before? Never no. competed at the games. We, uh, Vince, myself, and another um, teammate, Kelly, it was our first time at regionals. First time at regionals? Yeah, we were pure yeah. rookies. So <laughs> being, on, being on the uh, the field of play out there and you're standing out there and you're hearing all these people screaming, I mean, what's the coolest experience, what's been the coolest experience so far being there? Winning an event? Probably that yeah. event yeah. win, yeah. What, which event did you get? The sprint. The sprint. The sprint. The sprint. You, were you like, oh, this is impossible, how are we doing this? <laughs> or were you like, oh, we expect to do this? We're I mean, all, none of us are bad at sprinting, so. Yeah. yeah. We're just like, let's just run our asses off. <laughs> so being here for the first time, is there anybody you're like a little giddy about meeting? You're like, oh shit, that's, that's Froning over there. Or that's, you know, Dan Bailey. I mean, who? Cara Webb. Cara Webb. Yeah, I still haven't met her yet, but. <laughs> really? Um, I don't know. I think it's really. impressive. I, yeah, I mean, I, it's, I it's get a little cool stoked. to be around Chris Spieler fan. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you always have a fan. You're, you, yeah. you you play the game, and there's right. people who you admire in the game. It's kind of somewhere. So now, what's this mean for you guys? Took 19th this year, going back home. What's the game plan? Kind of undecided yeah, right now. Up in the air. Um, you know, some people might be moving. We don't know yet for sure. It's just kind of we don't want to separate. We all love each other. We yeah. all had so much fun through the past eight months. Um, the whole process has just been really fun. So we're we're sad it's over, but it might you know we don't know we don't know what's in store for next year. Well, we'd love to see you guys back at the games. All right, 
That'd be awesome. Yeah, yeah. And I'll see you guys down in Jersey. I'll Hell be down yeah. there next week. We'll go yeah. pump some iron. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just set a sundial for me. I'll be finishing when you guys uh, <laughs> when you guys are going to bed. Yeah, it's going to take me a while. Guys, thanks so much for stopping in. And we'll catch back up with you guys in a little bit.